Okay, I decided to show you guys how I made my little boo cupcakes. Uh, there's nothing terribly fancy about them, and they're really easy to do. So let's just get started. Oh, here's here's the little boo cupcake for you. You can see that. Got a little spider web, and then the word boo. So. I'll show you how to make your frosting kind of smooth, and then I'll show you how to do the spider web part, and then we'll write boo on it. That's not too hard to figure out how to do the writing. Okay, so we're going to start off with just a little bit of frosting and a cake spatula. A pretty decent sized one, your medium sized. Not a humongous, but not a tiny one either. So we're going to take just a little dollop of frosting, about like that, and you don't want to get too big or or too small, but you know, just a decent amount. If you get too much, it's okay. You can pull some of it off and keep working. If you get not enough, you know, you can add some more. So it's not crucial that you get the exact amount. Okay, so we've got our dollop. We're just going to kind of set it on to the cupcake. And we're going to start just tapping. And we're going to just kind of come out to the edges and just pat. It's kind of like a, just a bouncing up and down. You guys can see that. We're just going to bounce all the way around this cupcake. And that's how, <clears throat> you know, a lot of people have problems icing cupcakes because they, you know, their edges are jagged and then the cupcake doesn't look very good. So this is a way to get those nice smooth outside edges without having to you know, work all day. And you can do this a lot faster than this. I'm just, you know, going slow to show you. So anyway, we've bounced up and down all the way around the cupcake. And so you can see the, the edges are pretty nice and smooth. So now that we're in the center, we're just going to kind of swipe off of there. So it's pretty smooth, as you can see. We've got the edges are nice and clean. We don't have, you know, jagged poking out all over the place kind of stuff that you you get with a you know typical cupcake. Alright, so then we're gonna do our spider web. And for our spider web we're gonna start with some black frosting and we're just gonna do a line around the center or around the outside, not the center. And this does not have to be perfect because we're going to kind of pull this frosting and you know move it around so it doesn't have to be perfectly smooth lines okay but then we're going to come into um, you know a little further in and do another circle and then do a dot in the center okay and then we're going to pick up our green frosting and if you want to you can do this all in black or all in green or you know purple or whatever you want but then we're going to do another circle right here and then one more circle in the center and if you can see my lines aren't absolutely perfect and that's okay because we're going to be using our little toothpick here and we're going to just take the toothpick and we're going to drag from the center out so stick it in there and just pull outward. Uh, you can clear off your toothpick with a napkin each swipe if you feel like it needs to be perfect, or you can just, you know, go if you're in a hurry. Because sometimes, you know, you want to make like five dozen of these cupcakes for your whatever party you're going to. So I'm just kind of swipe out. I tried to make sure, uh, if you could see that, that was the line where all of my frosting connected. I tried to get them all in a line, and then I just swiped down and that made that whole thing just disappear. So you can't really see where it stopped and where it started. And then you just keep going and get all of your lines done. And that's how you do your little spider web. I'm sure a lot of you have already seen that before. And then... We're going to take our orange frosting and we're just going to write the word boo. Um, for writing, it's it's pretty basic. You just uh, stick your tip uh, right down on the surface when you start. 
start squeezing and kind of pull up a little bit off of the surface and then set it back down where you end. And then you release your pressure and pull away. Now that'll get you a nice smooth line instead of, you know, when you try writing it gets jagged if you, you know. And when you get to the end you want to make sure you release the pressure so that um, you don't get those points like, you know, a mile long. So then we're going to do our B. We're going to come in, stop your pressure, and then go again for your other loop. And then we're going to do an O. Whoops. Came out a little bit. And then another O. And then a little exclamation point. And there you go. There's our little Boo Cupcakes with a spider web. It's pretty fun. Hope you guys all enjoy your Halloween and trick-or-treating and whatever parties you're going to.